space area we're living has got a, a phenomenal stretch for you. It's called a sideline uh, leg or sideline with rotation uh, and uh, uh, an overhead reach. If you really want to get crazy with it, uh, it's best to have something that you can uh, rest the leg on because you want to keep a uh, foam roller perfect for this. Because you want to try to keep the hip uh, neutral and the feet in line or the knees in line with the hips. Uh, so you're going to lay it down and try to open it up, nice and tall. Uh, through here. So you want this hand going to push up towards the ceiling. In fact, having like a part push down so that we lock down that shoulder is a really good idea. From here, this hand is just going to pull it down. So your opposite arm, so we've got uh, opposite arm as uh, opposed to the way the body is rotated towards. From here, lowering it down good and low uh, with that hand out in front, setting that scapula. Draw the hand back up. Pull that back of that hand on my left hand all the way down as low as we possibly can. We're getting this great stretch right through the chest. We're really setting our shoulder here. We're getting this great rotation through the trunk. Uh, and then, of course, keeping the, the hips nice and neutral all the way throughout it. Pull it back up. Now, when we get really, really advanced through this movement, one of the things that we can do is actually activate with a low trap activation. So we pull that arm uh, that we just uh, uh, laid down onto the ground even deeper into the ground, ideally getting it to the point where the back of the palm is uh, resting on top uh, of the ground. If we don't have a whole lot of mobility through here, what you're going to see is it's going to stop a little bit short. So this is a great stretch to kind of loosen it up right through here. That's a sideline rotation with reach.